Hey guys, it's Rachel here, and today I'm going to be filming the TMI tag, and I was tagged on this by Riley Marie 1196 so thank you very much, Riley, and I'm actually really excited to be doing this because lately I've been thinking about the personal lives of booktubers and YouTubers all the like, so I think this will be an interesting way to kind of get to know each other, so yes, let's go ahead and get started. Number one. What are you wearing? I am wearing a brown shirt that my boyfriend and I have matching ones of. I really love it. Question number two, ever been in love? Yes. Number three, ever had a terrible breakup? Yes. Number four, how tall are you? I am 5'3", just about. Number five, how much do you weigh? Um, I'm not telling. Number six, any tattoos? Nope, not yet. Number seven, any piercings? Yes my ears. Number eight, OTP. I will tell you right now that I had no idea what OTP meant and I had to go and look it up. I guess I'm just getting old. Um, but let's see here. Who's my favorite OTP? My favorite OTP is going to be Yelena and Valak from the stu the study series by Murray V. Snyder. Number nine, favorite show, The Walking Dead. Number ten, favorite bands, too many to name, too many to name, but some that I'm really enjoying, I go through music quite often, but some things that I'm really enjoying that right now are going to be like kind of dubstep house type music, so I'm really enjoying the Swedish House Mafia, I'm really enjoying Nero, the Glitch Mob, I'm really enjoying Calvin Harris, I'm really enjoying a lot of those type of, of, of bands. Number 11, something you miss, my niece and nephew. Number 12, favorite song. I don't think that I have a favorite song to be completely honest with you. There are many, many songs that I absolutely love, but I don't know that there is one specific song that I love more than all the rest. Number 13, how old are you? I am 23 and I will be 24 on March 15th. Number 14, zodiac sign, Pisces. Number 15, quality you look for in a partner. Um, I definitely look for wit. I, I think it is awesome when somebody has the ability to come up with something very witty and funny in a, just a matter of seconds. Number 16, favorite quote. Um, my favorite quote is going to be from the movie Eternal Sunshine and Spotless Mind and it actually has to do with the movie title and it reads as such. How happy is the blameless vessel's lot, the world forgetting by the world forgot, internal sunshine and spotless minds, each prayer accepted, each wish resigned. And that is by Alexander Pope. Number 17, favorite actor. I have a lot of actors that I really like, but I really, really love Timothy Oliphant. Number 18, favorite color, green. Loud music or soft music? Um, it depends on my mood. If I'm working out or something like that, I like loud. If I'm driving, just thinking, then soft. Number 20, where do you go when you're sad? Uh, you know, I go into my library type room. We live in a three bedroom house and this is my room. So I go in here when I'm feeling kind of sad. Number 21, how long does it take you to shower? Uh, it depends on if I'm shaving my legs or not. If I'm not shaving my legs, I'm probably like, I don't know, like 10, 15 minutes. If I am shaving my legs, it can take upwards to 20, 25 minutes. Number 22, how long does it take you to get ready in the morning? It also depends on what I'm doing. If I don't give a crap what I'm looking like, then like maybe five minutes. But if I do give a crap, could be 30 minutes to an hour depending on where I'm going. Number 23, ever been in a physical fight? Uh, no, I'm a lover, not a fighter. Number 24, turn on. Uh, like I said, wit, turn off. Uh, cockiness. I definitely don't like somebody who is full of themselves. Uh, the reason I joined YouTube. Um, you guys, pretty much, I enjoy interacting with you guys. I enjoy talking to you guys about books. And so that is the main reason that I chose to start making YouTube videos. Number 27, fears. Uh, fears. I've got a few of them, but the, the main one is probably going to be like elevators and escalators. Number 28, last thing that made you cry. What was the last thing that made me cry? Um, I think last week I had a really, really bad night at work and I came home and I just bawled my eyes out. 29, last time you said you love someone. Uh, probably like 30 minutes ago to my boyfriend. Meaning behind your YouTube name. To be honest with you, I don't know that there's like any specific meaning to Books Undone. I love books and, I, you know, I don't know. I just... I was thinking about what I wanted. I wanted something kind of original, so that's what I kind of went ahead and went with. Number 31, last book you read, and that is going to be Shadow and Bone by Leigh Bardugo. Last show you watched, I just finished watching The Walking Dead about 20 minutes ago. 
the book that you are currently reading. I am currently reading uh, The Final Empire by Brandon Sanderson and I am also currently reading The Diviners by Libba Bray. Last person you talked to. The last person I talked to was my boyfriend. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. Um, I just finished texting my sister not too long ago. Favorite food. I don't know that I have a specific favorite food. I like a lot of foods. Fatty problems. 37 place you want to visit. I really am wanting to go back to Chile because I went there as a translator at one point. I would also really like to go to El Salvador to uh, visit my family because that is where my mom's side of the family is from. Last place you were. Um, to be, I, I don't know what this question means like last place you were. If you're talking about like here was the last place I was but if you're talking about somewhere else then at work would be the last place that I was. Do you have a crush? Uh, yes. Last time you kissed someone. Um, probably an hour ago I kissed my boyfriend. Last time you were insulted. Um, I have mentioned before in a video that I am, um, I have a job of upper management so I am insulted quite often. In fact, I was insulted the other day by a team member that I had that did not like something that I, ha I had asked her to do. Um, so um, probably, I probably get insulted pretty frequently but I don't really mind it. Favorite flavor of sweets? chocolate and I really love apple. Not together, that's weird, but definitely definitely chocolate and I really love apple as well. What instruments do you play? I played the piano for a couple of years but the one that I stuck with, with the most was the violin. Favorite piece of jewelry? I have a couple and I'm actually wearing them specifically for this video. These earrings that I have, they are pearls with little diamonds on them. They were a gift from my boyfriend when we started dating. This necklace here that my dad got me and it is the Star of David and it has a little cross on the inside and also the ring that I'm wearing. It is just this little ring and in Hebrew it has a, a thing from Song of Solomon and it says um, my beloved is mine and I am his. Last sport you played. I have never really paid, played sports. Um, so. I did a 5k not too long ago, does that count? My favorite chat up line or pick up line? I have never used a pick up line. I will never use a pick up line. Um, but I'll say one just to make you guys happy. Are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. Have you ever used it? No, again, I don't use chat up pick up lines. It's nah, not for me. Last time you hung out with anyone and I hung out with my boyfriend last. The last question is, who should answer these questions next? And I think that you're supposed to tag like 10 people to do so, but honestly, I think I've seen like everybody do this one. So I'm going to just tag a couple of people. Eliza from Ramley Bookworm, Brant J from Brant Does Read, and also Hope from Hope Loves Books. So I hope you guys all do this. It was a lot of fun. It was actually a little bit more difficult than I thought it was going to be. And so, Yes, uh, thank you so much for watching, commenting, liking, and subscribing, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! But basically the point of this tag is just to uh, showcase 10 books that have greatly influenced your life.